Hi there people! Well, you have very little time left for your JE Advanced exam and right now, instead of learning something new, what can immensely benefit you is revising what you already know so that you can convert all that into your absolute strengths. Now, question arises, how can we proceed with the revision of topics in mathematics? What is the correct game plan? What is the correct strategy? Well, let's dive into the details, let's dive into the discussion. See, if we analyze the past three to five years J advanced papers, then the chapters which have successfully held the maximum weightage in the paper and have been an all-time favorite of the J advanced team include matrices and determinants, probability, which includes the understanding of PNC, obviously. You have vector and 3D, you have AOD, you have definite integration, sequence in series, complex numbers, and some mixed questions of area under curves and differential equations. These are some of the most promising topics from where good number of questions have been consistently asked in the paper year after year, and that is something which we can even expect in the upcoming exam. But having said that, Let's face the fact, not all fingers are the same, not all students are the same. Your level of preparation might be different from somebody else's level of preparation. So, hear me out. If you are someone who is not very confident about revising all of these topics and feels that I only have bandwidth and mental space to complete a few important topics, then my suggestion is Please prioritize the revision of AOD, matrices and determinants, probability and conic sections. But after doing this much, if you're someone who feels that I still have the energy, the stamina to study more, to practice more, to revise more, then go ahead with definite integration, complex numbers and vector 3D. Towards the end, I would just like to say that while revising, start with the subject which you are most confident about because you will be able to get done with it quickly and then you'll have enough, an ample amount of time to devote to other subjects. Also, while revising, prioritize the revision of low input and high output topics. All right, and last but not the least, indulge yourself in time-bound practice. So while revising, when you're solving questions, make sure you keep a stopwatch so that you can work on your time management and you can also regulate your accuracy. Just implement all these points which I've shared with you and it will definitely give a huge boost to your score. All the very best.